How's it going, YouTube? My name is Richard Right away back again with, of course, another Call of Duty Black Ops 3 video for you guys today. Now, today, what I'm actually going to be doing is actually a cut commentary. So, yeah, I really don't do uh, cut commentaries that much, like, at all on my channel. But, you know, it's always good to, you know, switch it up, and I thought I would kind of tell, like, I don't know, like, kind of like a little story or just some kind of background of how uh, kind of my Xbox career kind of went almost. I'm going to be talking about uh, kind of just, like, my past gamer tags and how I got the name right away, because a lot of people do ask me, you know, how do you, how'd you get your YouTube name? Like, what is the thought process? How did you even get it? Yeah, I'm just gonna be, you know, just playing Call of Duty and just basically telling you guys my past gamer tags and how I got the name right away. So I hope you guys enjoy this video, uh, this different type of video. Also, I kind of got this idea from uh, Noisy Butters. She's a really good YouTube friend of mine. So I'll leave her link down in the description. You guys can go check it out. She kind of made a video similar to this, you know, how she got the name Noisy Butters. So just kind of got her this idea from her and I want to give her credit. So her link will be down in the description. But anyway, guys, moving on to my first gamer tag. So my first gamer tag I ever created, actually, I kind of had two first gamer tags on Xbox. Xbox, I got it on Christmas Day, I believe in 2012 or 2011, something like that. So anyway, yeah, I made my account. Uh, actually, my sister got me as like a Christmas present, uh, Xbox Live, a 12-month Xbox Live. And uh, when I was creating my account, I was I not I was not like 18 or 16, however however old you have to be. So I was too young to actually play on like Xbox Live or something like that. So I created created my gamer tag, put the Xbox Live code in there, and then I couldn't play Xbox Live because I was too young. I put my birth date in like too young. So uh, yeah, that was a waste of a 12-month Xbox Live code. But yeah, so the the gamer tag I chose for that account was NY Rangers 915. So NY meaning I'm from New York and Rangers is my favorite hockey team. I'm into hockey and then 915 is my birthday. But since I actually couldn't use that account, I had to make a totally new account and make myself uh, know the appropriate age so I can actually play on Xbox Live. And so I pretty much had the same exact gamer tag, just changed the numbers at the end. I had NY Rangers uh, 1024. So 1024 is actually my brother's birthday. So that's how I kind of came up with that. That was like my first, I guess, two gamer tags. Seriously though, guys, I'm not going to lie. I love Lamb. But after a while, I thought the NY Rangers kind of gamer tag was uh, kind of, you know, just boring in a sense. So at the time, I was really into wolves. Um, wolves were like the coolest things at the time. I was just a really big fan of wolves. So uh, actually, I changed my gamer tag to XX Direwolf XX. Yeah, those X's, I, the X's were cool back then, man. X's and gamer tags were like the, the coolest thing. Anywho, moving along, I believe I actually started to join a clan with a couple of my friends. So an IRL friend told me about this clan that he joined. So I said I wanted to join the clan, and the clan name was X Twisted X. That was the name. X's were the thing back then. Uh, but yeah, it was X Twisted X, and my name in the clan was X Twisted X Wolf because I liked wolves back then, and that was my name. I was in the Twisted Clan. I felt like a pretty badass. But then. And the leader of the clan actually uh, decided to change the name from Twisted to X Fatal. So we're in the Fatal clan now. I was X Fatal X Disciple because I thought Disciple was literally like a badass name. So I was X Fatal X Disciple. So yeah, so there I am. I'm in the X Fatal clan. But then the clan just ended, I think. Like, I think the leader, like, literally just hated, like, Xbox and stuff like that I'm playing. So he was like, you know what? I'm done. I, I quit the clan. And the clan just ended. So I was literally was stuck with a clan gamer tag. So I was like, all right, man, this is not going to work out. I, I have to change my gamer tag ASAP because I'm not in the clan anymore. You know, why would I keep the gamer tag? So, so actually, uh, till this day, I'm a huge fan of a game called Kingdom Hearts. It's one of my favorite games, if not my favorite game of all entire time. I love Kingdom Hearts so much. You guys probably know it, or you might not know it. Look it up. It's, it's amazing. But anyway, one of the songs from the official soundtrack was called Sherzo di Note. And I'll have, you know, my gamer tags on the screen, obviously, so you guys can see it. But that was my gamer tag at, the, at that point. But honestly, like, a lot of my friends and I used to play Search and Destroy. And when people called my gamer tag, they never got it right. They would be like, Sher Sherzo? Sher like, they never got the gamer tag right. So I was like, well, shit. Like, I have to change my gamer tag. So this time around, a couple of my buddies from school, actually, uh, we all just decided to start a clan together. We all just, you know, decided to rock the same exact gamer tag, be cool when we play together and join lobbies and whatnot. We, we just wanted to have, like, a similar gamer tags. And that clan was actually called Vital. Uh, we just thought Vital was, like, the coolest, like, name at the time. So we all had X Vital in the beginning of our names. Anyway, so yeah, I was in the Vital clan, and uh, my name when I was in the Vital clan was X Vital X Fuse. I just went through so many gamer tags. I, I want to know how much money I actually spent on just changing my gamer tag. But yeah, I was X Vital X Fuse, and then I think all but a bunch of my friends wanted to change the name because we did not like Vital. Like I, I, we changed the name again, I guess. I, I don't know. So we decided to actually uh change our name to Aura. Like Aura was the clan. We were in Aura clan, and uh, I think I still went with Aura uh, Fuse. So yeah, that was my gamer tag. But yeah, I was in the Aura clan. And then guys, just just wait for it. Are, are you ready? I had to change my gamer tag again. Yeah, I had to change my gamer tag again because we were in Aura, and there was already an Aura clan. So my friends and I were like, well shit. 
shit. Like, there's already an Aura clan. We're not original. We, we gotta change our gamer tags again. So, we all have to change our gamer tags uh, from Aura to something else because Aura was already taken. We were like, we, we gotta change it, man. So, like I said before, I'm, I'm a huge fan of Kingdom Hearts and I decided to change my gamer tag to the 13th member. And if you guys, if you guys play Kingdom Hearts, you guys will know that. But the 13th member is kind of like a big kind of part of Kingdom Hearts. And that's what I had for a really, really long time, just the 13th member. But then the 13th member was actually kind of like my last uh, official gamer tag uh, because at this moment, I, I really wanted to get into YouTube again. Uh, YouTube a, was a big thing that was kind of on my mind. So this is when kind of like Raid Away comes into hand. I don't know how I created the name Raid Away. It, it kind of just popped in my head. I, maybe I was playing Black Ops 2 Raid because I know Raid was a good map, but I literally just don't know how I came up with the name Raid Away. It just kind of popped into my head. And when I thought of it, I guess I was just thinking Raid, you know, Raid Away, I guess came in. And uh, right when I thought of it, I thought it was like the most unique thing at the time. Like it still like sounds so unique and I thought it was unique. So I, I went with it. I was like, you know what, Raid Away? That sounds really badass. I'm going to go with it. So I started my YouTube channel. I named myself Raid Away. So yeah, that's how I started. That's how I came up with Raid Away. And then I started my YouTube channel Raid Away uh, back in like 2014 or 2013 or something like that. I've had this channel for a while. But that is my gamertag history, guys. I thought it was pretty interesting. I thought I would tell you guys. But anyway, guys, that is my history. And that's pretty much how I came up with Raid Away. Like Raid Away, it just popped into my head. I, I know it's a pretty bad story. But yeah, that's how I came up with Raid Away. That is my kind of gamertag history in a sense. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. It's a little bit different. Always remember to drop a like, subscribe if you guys are new. Hopefully you found this video interesting and you got to learn a little bit more about me. Uh, but that's pretty much it. Hopefully you guys enjoy and I'll see you guys next time.